You live in the gym, you train in the gym, you eat in the gym, you sleep in the gym. And that's all you're doing six days a week, twice a day, two or three hours a day, is training, 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 and then you fight. These are the shorts I won my first professional title in, in Thailand with. They, uh, they say Rising Star, and I've been wearing them to train for this fight just because I feel like this fight's gonna take me to another level of stardom, so I'm ready. I spent eight months in Thailand in 2010 with one of the best fighters in the world, Bo Kao Ban Chame. Just watching him and how hard he trained, how dedicated he was, and how he just worked and worked and worked at his craft, it was no surprise why he was so great in the ring. Before we clinched a lot, I was able to beat him in the clinch. And I hit him with a lot of elbows, I hit him with a lot of knees. I was able to get the win on points. This time there'll be less clinch, so we're gonna be fighting more on the outside. I believe I'm gonna be able to beat him the same way I did in the clinch from the outside. And uh, I'm ready to show the world that I'm the best fighter pound for pound. You know, I've won five different world titles, but a lot of people have doubts of what I can do in kickboxing if I'm still able to um, be as successful without my, what people say is my strongest weapon, which is my clinch. But I believe that um, I'm a dynamic fighter and I can fight regardless of the rule setting. So it's, it's, gonna, it's gonna catapult me from being a world champion to being the world champion of world champions.